And we're underway here at High Marsh in Adelaide. This touch of the ball there for Stella Rigon, the captain here, and uh, Adelaide United making an energetic start. Cotter in the action as well, and uh, no one aren't having too many problems getting between those Adelaide lines. No, they are, but they're actually playing quite uh, direct themselves, I think. they. Well, burst three there from Dragana Clayage. She's got Jones waiting in the middle, does opt for Jones. Christian Jones is dispossessed, wins the ball back, has done well, and wins the side a free kick. It was good play. Uh, Melbourne Victor on the, on the back foot here. Weren't really in a good position to, to defend, and, and I've had to make this, I guess, this scrappy play here where bringing Jones down in a really bad position for them. But uh, positive signs for Adelaide again. They're looking to go forward with every single ball, and by doing so, puts your, puts your team in a really good position like this. Bianca Henninger, the... Houston Dash goalkeeper instructs her wall. Protecting the left side of her goal. Stella Rigon delivers the free kick. Does go over and it's in. And Adelaide United has their first goal. Captain Stella Rigon starts their season with a beauty. It was a gorgeously lined up free kick. What a way for her to open her account. Oh, Steph, it was a wonderfully taken free kick here. It had a really good amount of power. Yes, it did take a deflection. But you'll see the captain, the new local captain for Adelaide United, steps up, hits it sweetly. It's taken the, the keeper off balance, but it's in the back of the net. Of course, we have a couple of those uh, players who've had injuries in the past season coming back. Sarah Walsh, it's great to see Celine Kurile on the uh, on the victory bench. It's been a while since we've seen her. He injured herself in round one last season. So great to have you back, Celine. Yeah, she's looking very fit too. Uh, we got to see a little bit of her in the warm up. So I'm excited to see her come on later. Monica sends the ball back to Willis, who can't clear. It's now in the touch of Dowie. And the England international has found parity. One all here in Adelaide. Natasha Dowie with the equaliser. And that was just a pure goalkeeping error there. Let the ball dribble loose. And Dowie's way too experienced. Picked that up easily and sent it home. Well, if you needed a clip to uh, to typify and uh, explain Dowie's game, that, that would actually have to be it. There's nothing in this play here. Monica's taken the ball back. It's a fine. Willis has taken a really bad touch, but who's there to actually put apply real pressure onto the keeper? Dowie. Whether she's working from the from the front line back into the back line in the midfield, she's always working. And that's probably why she's going to be successful in this league. Really good finish there. Right time, right place, but she's made it happen. There's certainly been plenty of action in the last five or so minutes. Quite 20 minutes gone here in Adelaide, and it is one all thanks to a wonderful free, free kick from Adelaide captain Stella Rigon. And a neat little equaliser from international Natasha Dowie for Melbourne. And Adelaide trying to go through again. A lovely ball there from Colaprico. And it is back in from Adriana Jones. And the former Newcastle Jet has her first goal for Adelaide United. Wonderfully fed by Sophia Puerta. And a superb finish, Adriana Jones. Well, put quite, quite simply, you will not see a better goal than that. I know we've just started the league, but uh, unbelievable combination play here, starting with Calaprico showing her class. First match, great through ball, splitting the defence. Get to see a great ball in here. Great finish from uh, Jones as well. But look at this perfectly pinpoint ball from uh, Huerta. This is the combination between the, the two Chicago Red Stars. Unbelievable splitting ball and, and great finish. Jones put a, a perfectly timed run in to finish that as well. Oh, we're going to see some goals here today, Steph. How about that ball from Henninger? <laughs> Actually manages to eventually pick out Natasha Dowie. Out to White on the right flank. White with her first touch of the game finds a header. Yeah. Dowie, and that is a second goal for Natasha Dowie. The English woman has a brace. 
and Melbourne victory has parity. What a ball there from Corral White. She has only been on the pitch for a couple of minutes, but a beautiful delivery, picking out the head of Natasha Dowie and a classy finish. Oh, what an impact from White. Second touch on the ball. Great, perfect ball in. And she's picked out Dowie. But for the kids watching at home, Dowie gets up, and where does she direct the ball? Perfectly timed run, but look, directs it back to where it come from. That way you actually, you generate the power from the ball and the cross. And you just need to direct it and have accuracy. But uh, only good strikers can do that, and guess who's on the end of it? has come back for Adelaide to have perhaps another go at setting up an attack. This is really cheeky here from Jones. Really late hit on the keeper. They're usually called up. <laughs> you know, they're protected in cotton wool, but it was it was very late. Nowhere near going over the line. I think Henning is probably experienced enough to know that Houston Dash number two is number two, two, one. Lydia Williams, who will see in a new shirt. She moves to City. And delivery from Ali Lattice. Oh, and there's a hit on that, and it is in the back of the net. What a beautiful goal to put the Lady Reds up. Three goals to one. And what a delivery that was. From Hodgson at right back. And the element of surprise is working for them today, Steph. Just when you think they're out of the game, they're probably not going to be able to produce anything. Balling from Hodgson. To be fair, Monica not picked up, but absolute perfect timing. Look at that. Far post. Absolutely beautiful. The crowd is going off here. Up again, 3-2. Where will this end? Scrambling, scuffling and jostling at the top of the 18-yard box. Ladder stands ready. It's up, it is 3-2 Curley. Headed down. Chance for Adelaide to mount another attack. Started by Campagnale, blocked off by Codger. Huerta puts a boot in. And victory off on a run, Leah Privatelli. Still running hard on debut. Now with Celine Curley. Curley can score. What a beautiful shot from Celine Curley. Unbelievable. And what a response coming back after nearly a whole season off injured. What a way to get back into the W League. Welcome back, Celine Curley. Oh, Lou, you can see the emotion on her face here, Steph. It has been a hard, hard road back for Celine Curley. She went to the Olympics in 2004 as a, as a youngster. And, and look, you get to see her here. She's 30, 40 yards out. She's off balance. She's looked up, picked a spot and hit it. It is an absolute screamer.